Welcome to Layla's Trick of Jewelry Design. Don't forget to thumbs up the video. Really appreciate it. Like, share, comment down below, and follow my channel. Now what I'm doing is I'm using some stretch cord. I'm going to do is I'm cut it. Okay. Oh, it's my shorter cord that I messed up. I'm going to put this on the end of it. I'm going to clip it in. I'm going to clip it in. Put that on. I'm going to use African wooden beads. Brown white marble beads. Copper glass pearl beads. Okay. That's one bracelet that we're going to be working on. This is the second bracelet that we're going to be working on. We're working on that one next. So we're going to put the African wooden bead on. The giraffe brown and white marble looking bead. And glass pearl. Well, happy hands design. I hope everyone had a wonderful day and a productive day. All is well with everyone. Hopefully, this video is not glitchy. It happened comes with glitches here lately. So, the pattern is just repeating itself. We're almost to the end of it. I see a fall of my bees here. And they are. You want to these colors will go to each other, but they do. And they're really complement one another. Also, well, the African bees, or the look of African for safari. Now, this will be a wonderful bracelet. So, um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to stretch this bracelet out some, okay? That's all I'm attempting to do. Just stretch it some. This is going to stretch over time. Now, we're going to make sure that all the bees are looking right. There they are. So, what we're going to do next now, we're going to tie it up. Okay, tie it. We're going to pull it tight. So you're going to tuck it inside of the button bead. You're going to tie again. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to get this. Sorry for the arm going across. Make sure I put this real tight. My hands are slippery so I can't do it with my hands. So I'm going to just pull in it tight as I can get it. Right. Okay. I'm really just making sure that this is not going to stay a knot. Now. See, it's still not right here. Not. My hand is so slippery from the motion. What I'm going to do so this won't come all the way loose on me, I just put this right there. Hold it. I'm going to use an 86,000. Put it on this paper right here. Don't put it on that little knot. Right here, see, it's going right here. Now, I have to do this again. Stretch it, stretch it,
Sushi. Trying to make it just stay right there in place because I'm going to have to cut off excess. I really want that not to sit so I can tuck it in that arm. Uh, and it wouldn't be. Okay. Got off the excess. So, now I have to pull it through. Disappeared. You don't see a knot, anything. So if it can look like a little small bracelet, but when it stretch out, it's going to be a nice ice bracelet. So I'm going to put it on my hand. Can you see it? This might fit a size six and a half. I have a, a large one. But it's a nice little bracelet. Yes, that's one. That's up, by the way. Bracelet number two. Okay. Let me try to get Lenny. Okay, I'm gonna use this again. Okay. I'm gonna set that aside. I'm gonna use that. That little flower silver bead here. I might use the disc. We have some double little round space beads. Some beads. Green adventuring beads. Green adventuring gemstones. Okay, so, as always, let's see first, I'm going to have to see how big my the holes are, which one is going to go in first. So, I have to hide it, and there's some silver space to be, so we're going to put that on first. Okay, we're going to take that off. I'm put these on. Do three. This is easy, easy, easy. Okay. Green adventuring gem. So we're going to put three on. That's hot. Then the space will be. Let's see. Four them. So let's, let's put this on. Enough space to be it on. Green adventure ring. Green, we're just going to repeat this pattern. You might have to take off one if it seems like it's too much. Or too spacey. I'm not picky about which adventuring gemstone gets put on here. But not one is a light thing because they're gemstones. So we're not going to even worry about that. Those are very small and it's uh green, but we're all going to measure now. We're gonna measure. Let me see where I'm at now. Okay. About right there. Hmm. So what I think 
this one going to do? Put this one on. And this. Let's see. Ooh. It's going to be too big of a bead. Too big of a bracelet. So I'm going to have to take that one off. Seven half for us right there. For this one. Right now I'm just drag that for the slip. I'm just twisting this so I can clamp it. And it didn't even work. this one. Two of them on there. It'll be okay to have two of them. It'll be okay. Just put that look if I had two of them on there. This is gonna seem like they're coming together in the back. Of course. Oh, yeah, that'll be okay. It'll be just fine because we love it. It'll be just fine. That's fine. Just yeah, fine. Now we can just go and tie this up. You don't have to wait. I'm about ready to 14 minutes and 35 seconds. I don't want this to be too long. Because I do want to put like a little dangle in here. And it's going to go on somewhere. I'm going to move this room around off the way because I don't need it now. We're going to have to figure out what kind of dangle we're going to do. My hands are slippery. Yep. Got together in the back and that looks nice. Now, we have here inside here. I can see they're good, but I got a hidden wheel. What are we going to do? I'm going to dry it up on me. It dries fast. I'm going to get some more glue right here. Right there. 
Okay. Now we're gonna stretch this again. So it's set, and then I can snip it off. So, see that? We put it tight. What I'm doing is I'm making sure I got some give in this bracelet. I'll give in it. I'm also trying to set this right here. Set that knot. I'm going to need six thousand knots. And I think I set it already. Now, I'm just going to pull it through. Make sure it's hit. back on here this stuff dry so fast and that's good that it do and it can also get messy but I like it it's fast kind of fast okay so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a dangle I think we can make a dangle here coming out of that I want that in there We're going to use some artistic wire. I'm going to make a dangle. I'm going to attempt to do it anyway. Attempt to do it anyway. So that means we just gonna have to use a little seed bead. A little old seed bead on the bottom. A little seed bead. Get on bottom. And right there. Voila. Voila. Now we got to see. See the little, see the little plant on there? It's a little hard to see. Okay, now. Now I said, I know how she's going to do this, but I'm going to do it. I want to dangle it off here. You know. I'm going to bend it down. I think it's been some off some concrete here. Okay. Let's see. I think I'm going to do this. I'm going to have to get a jump right now. That's okay. This is what you call design on the fly right here. I'm in camera shot for you all. I need to be like, how come they in camera shot? Oh my goodness, now I see why. You really have to pay attention to what you're doing. And suppose that you were just doing this and not being on camera. Then the, the head pins are very hard, so then these good flimsy ones. 
I'm going to fly. Okay, I'll go. Cut this little piece off right here. See that little piece? It's gotta go. Gotta go bye-bye. Bye! -bye. bye, -bye. You got them hot stuff? One of these is like Jessica. This brother. Bye-bye. I love that show, Hocus Pocus. I got Hocus Pocus too. Yes, this year I'll be able to get a chance to watch it. Gotta watch my Hocus Pocus. With Binks. We're at the park and I wanna see it. I smell children. And of course, Miss Bit Midler herself. That's my girl. Okay, now we gotta get the iron. And I have some iron and I can put them away. So give me that. Okay, we got Just like that, I'm back. Now this is, yes, of course, a stretch bracelet. But I'm still going to put it in a dingo on A little something extra after. A little something, something. That's what I like to say. A little something, something. Now, I think it's where do I want to place it. Place it right here. Let's see if I can get it in there. Just like that, I got it in there. Hello, and how you doing? There's a way, there's always a way. So, see, I have the dangle. Give me a little bracelet. A little dangle on it. I should put another thing on it, I don't know. I don't want two things on it. I think one is enough. I'm trying to get all that fancy. Some few minutes talking to this video, and that's enough for today. I'm trying to make my videos a little shorter. I need to clean up my area. And there we have what we have. The green, crackle glass, the green, the victory, and silver accent beads, stretch bracelet. Then we have the African theme bead with African wooden beads, brown and white dragon beads to me, and copper glass pearl. Okay, so the quick two beads. And some of so y'all can get a good look. Once again, I want to thank you all. For stopping by Lay Lay's Artistic Jewelry Design Channel. Once again, don't forget to thumbs up this video. Share it with family and friends. 
like it, subscribe, and follow me down. Um, go out and be a blessing to someone, and you be as blessed as well. Have a wonderful day.